Hello, I'm Boss Charlie Sims coming to you from Manchester, England. If you didn't know already, Manchester is the northwest of England. We're known for the glorious B, the Gallagher brothers, and football. If this is your first time watching me, then you won't know. I've been playing Sims for about two decades now, and this is my first Let's Play. This is episode two. Episode one was done on a different mic, I should say. Um, I've I've invested in a bit of a better mic, so the mic the mic and the sound probably isn't that great on episode one. I'm not gonna lie. Um, <clears throat> the, the content's probably not even that great either. If I'm if I'm hundred percent honest, but you know you you have to live and learn, don't you? This is what we do. Uh, yeah, the sound wasn't great because I was kind of using my PS4 um, headphones, the gold the gold pros i think they're called which which are great for for what i use them for on the ps4 and even just listening to the game on the on the pc they're great for that as well but obviously they're not they're not great to chat into they're not they're not um you know a mic for for recording like proper things and that so yeah that's that so here we are we are back with bob and eliza bob has just finished work i think i left it when he was still in work but the man is so tired let's get him to bed oh but, but as if he's gonna sleep on the bench he's gonna go up to bed isn't he come on up to your own bed bob let's be having you good lad and eliza is still just watching the tv perhaps she could go to bed actually and then they're gonna get up at a reasonable hour in the morning. I'm just gonna turn the object sounds down because um, whenever I zoom into anything, it, it yeah, it's just well loud object sound. That would be that one, wouldn't it? All right, let's make it about the same as the uh, the old. Ah, so pedantic. Yeah, there we go. Let's try that. Okay. Okay, so I think this episode, what we're going to do is we're going to, um, what are we going to do? We are going to give them a makeover. We're going to do that tomorrow. And we're, we're also going to work on Bob's satisfaction points because we want to change it so that he, he's not gloomy anymore. Like, so, you know, he's, He's, he's happy, man. We want to make him happy. We want to make him happy. We want to make Eliza happy. We want to do this. In my last episode, I was saying that I wanted to give Eliza a bit of a makeover just because I don't think that she is... Um, she's where she should be. I'm, I'm actually just going to turn this volume right down, I think, because it's just quite annoying. It's just it's just going really... No Wait, is the... U of the UI, that's the user interface, obviously, sound effects, of sound effects, that's the bloop bloops, voices, you're alright, you can actually, you could probably go down a little bit, uh, yeah, I'm gonna turn the, this down, maybe like 10%, 8%, ah, 8%, okay, let's do that, that's fine, 8% it is, okay, okay, <clears throat> uh, at some point in this, it just doesn't seem to have gone down in some point in this we we are gonna we're gonna give bob a proper makeover i mean i'm gonna let him start using the gym equipment and stuff in his room because he's got it so he may as well use it um you know he's got oh he's got a woodworking table i would have never had bob down as a craftsman okay learn something new every day i suppose all right i'm gonna send a oh see see what happens what was it I looked at one vampire thing the other day, and this is what happened. Wait, I didn't even look it, actually, did I? It just come up as a win. You know what, Lilith? I'm ignoring you, mate. I am not answering that door. You can... You can do one. Oh, one, two, one, do one. Um, right, so she's just watching TV. You know... Oh, she's watching a film, isn't she? Watch The Adventures of Spaceship Simulation. Ah, oh, oh, credits are rolling. Right, sod that. Go to the toilet and then get to bed, I'd say. And then it's gonna hopefully fast let's fast forward and now because all she's doing is going to the toilet and going to bed. And then at least it'll um wash your hands, go, 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 and then I'll play it. <laughs> yeah. And then it'll fast forward itself until somebody wakes up. Oh. Oh, it's not going to do that. Okay, I will do it myself then. Oh, look, and now he's calling me as well. What is this? Vlad. 
Vlad, hello there. I just wanted to welcome you to the community. And that's a lovely neck you have there. Oh, Vlad, leave it out, mate. All right? We're not, we're not doing that. We don't want anything to do with you. Do not make me go into Manage Worlds and X you all out, because I will. I will. Honestly, if you guys stay to your neighbourhood, there shouldn't be a problem, okay? It's too sunny in Willow Creek for you guys. You'll burn. Uh, yeah, so these are just these are just sleeping. Let's get this fast forwarded. Uh, let's go to Bob actually because he's probably got things that he needs to do for work and stuff. Or oh, he needs a toilet. When you when you're finished, Bob, uh, cook two meals well inspired and cook five excellent meals. Oh man, no pressure, no pressure. Um, oh sorry, I should apologize in advance because i am going to do weird accents and stuff like that and i'm not saying i'm good at any of the accents and i'm really 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 sorry if i offend anyone um i'm from manchester though so i mean our accent always gets the mick taken out of it manchester is what most people say we don't say manchester like that unless i did just say manchester like that and in that case i apologize but so, so yeah, what I was saying is I, I will probably throw in a few little cheeky accents there. As I said, maybe not good. But, you know, I'm, I'm not bothered. I'm, I'm here for this. I'm here for everything. I'm just going to speak, speak into this mic like I am talking to a friend. Though, I must say, I don't have that many Sims friends. And by don't have that many, I mean I've not got one. Not one friend that plays The Sims. I've got a friend that will listen to my Sims stories. But I can just see it in her eyes and she's just like, just shut up. I don't care. You know, while I'm speaking about my fifth generation of Lotharios. But whatever. Right, anyway, let's get Bob at it. He's cooking and he, I think he's got bad needs. I kind of wanted not to put up the needs bar like this. I kind of just wanted to leave it there and just do what what kind of pops up. So let's let's try that. I mean, I'm trying so much new stuff in these Let's Plays. It's It's... It's new for me, it's new for you, it's new for everyone. So yeah, he's just cooking. He's not got work till... Um, oh, he's he's off for like two days, that's good. Oh, that's actually really good because we can get his... Uh, we don't want a B-box. Buy a washing machine. Yeah, these would definitely have washing, wouldn't they? I mean, let's give Eliza at least something to do in the day. Let's give them a washing machine. Move the bin over, let's put some washer dryers there. They would definitely have, like, both the washer and the dryer. I've got some Sims that just have a washing machine. Uh, uh, even some Sims that just have dryers. But these would definitely have both of them. Um, I'm in the wrong bit. Where are we? Where are we? Washer, dryer, where are you? Um, okay, where are we? Where are we? Uh, so usually actually i should probably say when i'm playing the sims like when i'm personally playing the sims with me and myself i usually just listen to like a podcast um i listen to my favorite podcast I'm not sure if i'm allowed to say the name of what podcast i listen to but i'm just letting you know that i listen to my favorite podcast uh, it's obviously not called that but it's pretty close look at this i'm just chatting rubbish and just not even getting what i'm supposed to be getting i can see her with like white appliances let's be honest i can't see her going around the norm uh going any different from the, no the bins in the way let's put the bin here oh that is so frustrating as if the bin wouldn't be able to go there and i know i could move the the bb move objects thing on and stuff like that but i really just don't want to be doing all that in this i just want to like i just want them to live their best life and in the meantime, you know, let's just, uh, this can go here. This can absolutely just go out, out of the kitchen. That's fine. Right near the back door. So then, you know, Bob or Eliza, whoever, when they're going out, they can just take it out with them. Um, I've not got a pop filter on this, uh, on this microphone. I don't know. I don't know if I've said many peas. <clears throat> but um, if I have and it's just popped down your ear, I really, really appreciate apologize see what i did then try to try to cut the old p out by saying it a bit slowly but yeah if if it is a problem and it is popping too much then i will most definitely get a a um ah what's it called a pop filter you know i've just thought they're gonna need a washing basket if they've got washing 
machines. So let's let's just type that in. Washing. Wash. Oh, it's ah. It's not even. Oh, I say ow because I've just whacked my uh, elbow. I always seem to hurt myself in these things. Laundry. Oh, you don't spell laundry like that. Come on, Charlie. Get your stuff together. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <clears throat> let's let's put it upstairs because it just. Well, they can kind of share a wash basket. I mean, it's going to be Eliza that does the majority of it anyway. I mean, Bob works and stuff, so it's it's only fair, really, isn't it? Right, so now he needs a shower. So let's give him... Oh, okay, he's going to go for a bath. That's fine. And Eliza is starving. Also, uh, no, we don't need to serve breakfast. Oh, I mean, why would she even try and get a portion of macaroni cheese? for a breakfast who does that especially when there's like eggs and scra like scrambled egg with bacon and it's excellent excellent quality by bob which is fantastico oh that would have done his thingy as well wouldn't it uh cook two meals while inspired well i can't see that happening anytime soon because he's really he's, he's sad I love that he's just got like his socks on a dressing gown and his socks i mean that is bob isn't it bob living his best life well, he's living his best life because he's not got work for a couple of days. I was like, oh, wait, though. If he's not got work, maybe they should take their vacation. No, no. You know what I'm going to do today? I'm going to take... I know. I'm going to actually go to the shopping shopping centre with Eliza, see if there's any cute little outfits or anything. Um, She's going to have a breakfast, and then she's going to go shopping into... Oh, can I never remember the name? the man you know what i'll say it when i see it rather than trying to make something up which is usually how i do things but i am gonna try and be oh unbelievable he's used eliza's bath and just threw his stuff all over the floor this is probably why she gets annoyed with him like come on bob put your stuff in the hamper what is wrong with you uh, oh, and I wanted to put some body hair on Bob as well, because that bare chest is just not the one. Oh, squeaky chair. Oh, it, my chair is probably squeaking, actually, because I fell off it the other day. I lent, I lent, do you know when you're in school and the teacher always tells you not to lean back on your chair because you're going to fall off it? Well, apparently, when you lean back on a chair that's got wheels, you fall off it at a much quicker rate. Um, so I did that. I ended up with a massive bruise on my leg. And now when I move in certain ways on my chair, it kind of uh, feels like it's going to, like, um, break. So if you do hear, like, a big thud and then a distant voice, just know. Oh, Cassidy, do you want to go on a date? Stop it. Does she want to go on a date? I mean, last time she tried this stuff, she'd had a few drinks at the bar, so she was... You know, she was kind of different. But now it's only like 10 to 10 in the morning. Would she Would she say, cool, let's go on a date? Or would she just be like, nah. Oh. Oh. I don't know. Okay. 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 Uh, you know what? It's 10 to 10. Eliza's not had a drink and she's got plans. So no, we're not going to go on a date today. What we are going to do is get her to put that washing in there great fantastic stuff look she's so annoyed because the house is messy so i think that she should just go out should she probably take bob with her shopping yes yeah let's do it let's take bob with her um where can they go to the oh, come on i already knew uh sorry magnolia promenade okay so this is what it's called and they could go to this big like this is a big a big retail store that they could go to let's try there so here they are over at the finger she's brought bob along with her bob i'm just gonna do what all guys do in stores bob is just gonna oh he's not gonna buy an item he just wants to sit down have you not got any chairs for bob just to sit in yeah there we go bob can sit and eliza is just like oh shopping i love it oh she kind of likes that um, right, okay, let's have a little loopsies around. Oh, it's kind of like furniture and stuff as well, isn't it, here? this Oh, have I even been in here before? 
Why do I feel like I've, I've not took advantage of anything in this game? Oh, there's no upstairs. Okay. Okay, I think I've come to the wrong store. There's not really many clothes in here. It's all just kind of like fitness wear, fitness wear. Walking around in the fitness wear. So we're not going to do that. What we will do is we'll go over the road because this kind of looks like a bit of a fancier shop. Uh, Cassidy, you're not coming with us. Ah, here we go. This shop looks far better. Far be Does that make sense? Much better. Much better would probably make more. Oh, look at this. I can kind of see Eliza. Mm, actually, I don't know. Can I? Oh, look at this. Bob should totally get something like this. Just for like, you know. Let's try on the outfit. He's probably going to moan about it. Oh, and Eliza can try on that actually. Because that's pretty cute. Oh, no. She went to purchase it. Don't purchase it. Try it on, darling. Right, let's check out Bob in this outfit. Oh, Bob. Check you out, buddy. Looking good. Do we think that Eliza would like the outfit? I mean, Bob would probably like the outfit, but I, mm, he probably is not going to buy it. That's just Bob for you. Unless he shows a proper interest towards it, I'm not going to buy the outfit. I mean, he's happy, but he's just eaten, so of course he's happy. Right, let's have a look at Eliza in this little cute thing. Uh, mm, um... Oh, here we go. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. Well, the nag at me be uh, no, she's not going to buy the outfit. I mean, she's definitely not going to buy the outfit. Uh, let's have a look upstairs. I'm sure there's stuff upstairs in this one. Yes. Yes, there is. That's a little outfit again. Not really. 100%. Sorry. Ah! That was... Oh, there we go. Bob's just found something. It's down, found something to do. Okay, I don't think there's actually anything here that she wants to buy. So, what we are going to do is take them home and then we are going to start on the... Um, oh, that's embarrassing. They've walked in in the same outfits. Look. Awkward. Oh, my. Oh, she's got a, a skirt on, though. Oh, she's got a skirt on. Oh, guys. This is what happens when there's only like two stores in the, in the whole of the, you know, eight or whatever it is, little cities. People just end up with the same outfits, man. You know, maybe they should shop shop out, shop out somewhere else. Uh, right, okay, let's get these guys home. I'm going to fast fast this so that they, they hurry up and get themselves home and then we can begin the makeover. And that should be interesting. Uh, I'm not sure if I've said I'm going to run this episode for about 30 minutes. So we've got about 13 left. <clears throat> um, I want to say as well that I do play other games other than just The Sims. But while I'm just starting this thing out, I kind of want to just stick to a game that I'm really, really familiar with. Um, rather than trying to concentrate on a new game and concentrate on the, the recording and stuff like that. Because I, I'm... I'm probably not that great at doing everything just yet. But give me time. Give me time. Right, Eliza, what is she doing? Oh, she's, she, I bet she's gone to that hall, the um, the retail store, retail shops, and and now, and all she could think about was this puddle. That's all she could think about. Who, wait, look at this. Not only is she wearing the most ugliest ring in the whole game, maybe the whole world, but she's got it over gloves. This is why she needs a makeover, because I did not do this. Okay, I like the idea of the characters, that's great. But I'm pretty sure they were just made with what was in the base game, and as we all know, that, that isn't a, a great amount of stuff. So let's... Um, let's change I, oh, I don't know if I should do the changing of the voice now or if I sh maybe I should just stick it out and if it really annoys me then I'm gonna I'm gonna change it but as for now I'm gonna leave it the way it is my phone is just going mad I don't you probably won't be able to pick it up but my phone is going absolutely mad in the background it's buzzing away i'm in a i'm in a, a hindu group chat so that'll that'll explain it um anyway i think she should grow her hair out or at least have like a 
cuter hair and let's maybe get rid of the glasses oh it's kind of her though isn't it but i think i think she can get contacts why wouldn't she have contacts um oh these are all like really wholesome hairdos i kind of don't want a wholesome hairdo i want i want something that's a little bit sassy and a little bit like i'm better than you sort of hairdo that's cute that's really cute <laughs> She, she actually looks so sweet. It's a shame that she's a... <coughs> you know. Maybe she's going to get a bit edgy. Ow, I don't know. Let me think. Let me think. Um, I'm going to pause the part here. I'm going to do do her up a little bit. And then I'm going to come back to it. Because I can't, I can't think out loud and do it. So, yeah. I'll be back. Okay, so I've been paused for a little while. I've just been making them over. So I've I've just put Eliza kind of in some preset outfits. Um, I'm not very good at the styling of Sims and stuff. Um, I'm not very good at styling myself, if I'm honest with you. Uh, so these are kind of what I've gone for. I think she looks nice. She looks like she's, you know, like she's happy. I love, I just love this whole outfit. And then we've got Bob. Where are you? Here he is. Oh, this is his summer wear. I mean, socks and sliders because Bob will definitely wear socks and sliders without a, without a doubt. I have just realised though, they have, he's, he's got, he hasn't got any wedding rings on. And that, wait, has he got wedding rings on? He has. He's got, he's got the one, the I don't know, I think that's kind of more of a, a girly wedding ring. I don't know, maybe maybe I'm just being pedantic. But he's not having a big diamond on his finger. Because that is for Eliza. Um, let's just get a ring on his finger. If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. Wait, am I allowed to sing that? I don't know if I am. I don't know what I'm allowed to do. I'll be honest. So if I'm not allowed to sing um, Beyonce's song, then just tell her to give me a call and we'll hash it out and I'm sure it'll all be fine. Yes, that is totally Bob. Let's get some, like, timbly boots on there. Like, trekker boots, walking boots pretty sure i'm not allowed to say that either no not black gray now nah, let's go for the, like the og color okay so this is them let's let's go and we're back into it back playing with bob and eliza eliza is obviously she's took her glasses off she's now got contacts she's grew her hair out she's let it just naturally be naturally curly and whatnot now she's gonna go and clean that puddle why is she still wearing this she can kind of just wear any old outfit now because i've put her in like pretty warmish outfits let's put her in this one it's nice and sweet let's clean up that puddle bob where you at shock right so you've got a couple of days off bob i actually think that you should go and work out for a little bit or maybe you should start a job uh, a jog do a little bit of cardio before we, um, before, you know, he gets thingy. He gets going with things. Where is Eliza? She is here. She's cleaned. Let's see if... No. No. Um, I want to try and build some skills for these. So let's, let's, um, let's practice a speech. Build up your charisma skill. We don't really have many skills. Um, charisma, fitness, and video gaming. I can't really see Eliza being a gamer, but, you know, the bug catches all of us at some point, I'm sure, whether it be a full-blown game or even just, like, a little kind of app on your phone. Everybody gets, like, everybody gets it. Oh, Eliza's things would... Right, okay, we can do this, and we can do this. So she wants... Some, she wants... She wants a dishwasher and she wants something for over 500 simalonies, simalonies, simbucks. Let's just call them simbucks. Simalonies. Is that how you say it? 
Possibly. Right, what does she want? Oh, she wants a dishwasher, doesn't she? Let's find a dishwasher. A dishwasher! Um, oh, what am I doing? Come on. Right, where are we? So the kitchen, they don't have a dishwasher already. I mean, Eliza is the dishwasher. Uh, oh, look, you can actually get one for over, so that, that would just do both wins, wouldn't it? Put it by the sink, because everybody seems to have theirs there. And then she should get these two ticked off, because, yeah. Nice. Uh, oh, shock, buy something else. Buy, buy a cat condo? We don't even have a cat. Oh, buy a wash tub. As if, as if Eliza is going to use a wash tub to do her washing. Come on. Come on. Right, the basket is stabinking. Bob is fatigued. He's going to need a bath, isn't he? Let's, let's give him a nice, let's give him a bubble bath. And Eliza, get back to what you was doing. You were practicing your speech. Let's, okay, let's get her to level two and then we'll, she can do the washing. In the meantime, we... Oh, Bob's just like... Look at him. He's just like running around the neighbourhood. Oh, there's another runner. Who's the other runner? This would be an... Uh, this would be like, you know, when you're... Uh, you're both doing the same thing. Uh, so they don't know each other, but they're just going to run past each other and kind of give each other the, the nod as if to say, you're right, runner. You are right, runner. Nice fitness wear, runner. Ooh, nice fitness wear, runner. And that is all just with a simple nod. Oh, their head's turned, though. Did you see that? Mm, okay. She's checking him out. She's thinking, okay, okay, check him running. I didn't know he could do that. There he is. He's going to flat. I've never, never been stuck on this house. Never been keen on it. I think it's such a bad built house. Um. Yeah, I don't know just makes no sense to me at all I, d I don't really like with playing with the longer run houses anyway like where you have to go right to the back to, to get where you're going I kind of like a more I want to be able to see everything you know from where I am right um oh oh I've been playing with tiny living and obviously in the micro homes your skills and stuff they go up so much faster because of the the perk on the the lot but these guys, these guys' perks are just uh, perks. Um, their um, their skills are just taking ages because yeah, because they're new, and everything just takes longer. I'm gonna speed it up and just until she gets two. Uh, if she is ever gonna get two, that is, it's going up so slowly. What are we on? Seventy, eighty, and you know it goes to about one hundred and twenty percent, right? Oh wait. Is that a little alien child? No, it's not an alien child. It just so happens that his hat matches his shoes. Why is he here? He should not be over here. He's from Solana. And why is he looking so smug with himself? What has he done? Where is he looking at this house? Okay. Okay. Right, okay. Let's get back to my actual Sims. Um, She is still dust. Where are we up to? 89% complete. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm so in love with all the new outfits that they've brought out recently in the in the last few games. I think they've all just been so incredible. Um just just really good, really nice outfits, like really nice. I usually just play with um with men to be honest with you. Because I don't know, they're easy to dress and stuff. But with the presets for the women, oh, it's so easier. So easier. Does that make sense? Yeah. What is Bob doing? Oh, he wants to come in here and look at the picture. Is that what he wants? Or does he want to, does he really just want to, like, give his woman a big hug? Right, there we go. She's done that, so now I'm going to X that out. Come on, Bob. Oh, oh well, they can still go to the bathroom while one another is in the bathroom. So their their friendship is still okay, isn't it? That's all right. 
So we've reached about the 30 minute mark on my video and I actually don't think I've done anything that I said I was going to do. I was going to build his satisfaction points. I mean, I've done a little bit. Uh, tell a joke. I can 100% do that. I can tell a joke. I can tell a funny story. I can Let's tell an inside joke. And what is the other one? Um, search vampire information. I don't want to search vampire information. You know? Oh, shock. Watch the TV. That he can do. Uh, watch TV, watch, oh, watch the channel, there we go, great. <coughs> oh, Bob, where are you? There he is, he's gonna go in, he's gonna go speak to Eliza. He should probably do some food soon as well, since as he's the chef, why is he not gonna cook? Let's serve some lunch after he's watched a wee bit of TV. Actually, what I could do is I could just pin this, and then I'll get rid of that. And then we'll serve dinner. What can he have? Oh, I don't know why, but spaghetti just like flew out the, flew out the screen at me. Maybe it's because I want spaghetti though. Or pasta. Just any pasta really. I love pasta. But this is not a pasta video. So I won't talk about it too much. But it is nice. It's very nice. Um, he's chatting with Eliza. Let's see how this is going to go. Okay, this seems to have gone well. You know what I want to do, though? I want to kind of get some photos around the house. So let's see if we can just, like, take a quick photo with Eliza. Maybe it would have been nicer not doing it in the bathroom, but... Oh, okay, he's going to go and cook first anyway, so that's fine. So is Eliza just, like, going to chill there now until she has to take a photo with him? No. No. Eliza, why don't you come and watch, like... I wouldn't imagine Eliza watches too much TV, but if she did, I reckon she'd watch, like, the Romance Channel or something, if that's what it's called. Like a rom-com. Something that doesn't really take itself too seriously. Whereas I think Bob probably watches every single documentary about everything in the world. That's probably why he's so, like, sad all the time, just because he... He, he just, it's just an information overload for him. He's always watching TV. There's always bad things happening on TV. I mean, that's why we play games, right? We like screens, but want to control what's happening on them. Be a gamer. Because being a, being a TV producer, I'm sure that's much harder than just jumping on The Sims. <laughs> anyway. Um... What is he made up? Oh, spaghetti, obviously. Right, Eliza, come and clean this up, actually, because you, you filled it up and you have not emptied it. And actually, you can do the trash as well. Oh, and we need to actually put the rock, wash on, don't we? As opposed to just leaving it there. Got quite a nice dining room. I mean, this house just screams family, doesn't it? And they've just, they've just not got a family. It's kind of sad, really. Oh wait, Eliza is feeling a little bit fruity. Perhaps, Eliza, you could get some food, sit down, talk to Bob. The both of are going to, you know, discuss things. Maybe this would be, maybe this could be the night that you two, like, you know, get to know each other again. I kind of want to fill their friendship bar up again, though, before I do anything, Um, you know, on them terms just because if you don't really like someone you're not about to woohoo with them are you oh bob my guy can you see all this green smoke around here he's sat here eating his spaghetti she's just about to go and get a portion and he's just farted in this room who'd even do that i would go so mad at um ben if he did that oh ben being my boyfriend um I actually hate saying boyfriend about my Ben because we've been together like 11 years now and I just don't like saying boyfriend because I feel like we're more than boyfriend and girlfriend. We're not married um, for whatever reasons, but yeah, I don't know. But anyway, yeah, Ben would never fart in the dining room before I'm about to go in there with my food because I'm pretty sure he knows I would be very upset with that. But... Eliza doesn't seem to mind. Let's get that away before anyone forgets. She's feeling uncomfortable with the filthy surroundings. Perhaps that's him. But no, she... Oh, it's this side, isn't it? It's filthy. Um, wait, though. Wait a minute. Let me just get these... Why do I need to pause? I don't need to pause it. Let's just get these talking about a little something. She's going to try and brighten his day, make him feel a bit cool. 
A telephone Ooh. story. Spino? <laughs> yeah, froze. Oh, sure. Sister. I love how the Sims talk. Uh -huh. uh okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm going to take this episode to 40 minutes. Um, And what did I say I was going to do in this episode? I, if you could see my desktop now, you'd actually see that I've got loads of little post-it notes everywhere. So there's no, um, what do they call it? Like dead air time. I'm, I'm really trying to work on not just not talking for a while. Um, but it's, it's it's actually quite a strange thing talking to yourself. Oh, I've got to tell you though, before I turned my game on and I couldn't, I couldn't, um, I couldn't hear anything and I was thinking, oh, maybe it's the settings because sometimes I jump from headphones to my speakers and whatnot, depending on who be home. So I, w I was jumping through it and whatnot. And then it, it just wasn't playing any sound. So me being the gamer and technical person that I am thought, oh my goodness, this is definitely something that's, you know, definitely wrong. So I'm looking for all the settings and stuff, changing everything, just, you know, trying to find out. I'm at it for like a good 10 minutes. I'm thinking, why is it not working? Yeah, what I'd done is I'd just pressed the off button on the side of my desk with my knee because I kind of keep the volume just under my desk where it's like a good a good place for me to reach with my hands, but I've turned it off with my knee and th and that's what why why the sound wasn't working. That's um yeah, that's me. I can take that post-it note off my computer now. Like I said, I've got a little post-it so there's no dead air time. And I've got things to talk to you about. And I want to be honest with you. Do you know what I mean? Like, you can probably hear the paper rustling around. I'm, I'm good at talking. But I, it's hard to keep talking if you've got no feedback. You know? Um, one of my other post-it notes as well does just say burglars and vampires. And I know exactly what that means. It means that I wanted to say please bring back the burglars and I know they stopped the burglars because of wait okay so I heard a rumor that it was because it gave people too much anxiety when the um, when they heard the burglar come in and trust me I get it because it gave me anxiety as well but games are supposed to give you some sort of like feeling you know like scared or something like if I play left for dead I, I, mate, my heart at the end of that is like it must be at least like 140 heartbeats per minute or something i'm telling you so yeah i don't i don't mind the burglars i don't mind them burglars i don't mind them like creeping around the neighborhood and stuff i just think it makes it for a better game if i'm 100 percent honest with you and also what gives you more than anxiety more anxiety than a burglar i can tell you right now it's a vampire have you ever seen one of those creepy little dudes creeping towards your house and then you think oh it's fine because i've locked my doors <laughs> no you didn't lock your door and they're in and they're gonna get you now that is worrying at least the uh burglars only took like tvs and stuff like like vampires are taking like your blood your your plasma should i say and that is not on right so she's got the wash on bob has gone to bob has gone to bed oh is she gonna go to bed with bob no she's gonna go on the computer let's get bob properly into bed um, and let's get Eliza to bed also. And this is where I'm going to end the part. Because I think it's good to end when their day ends. It just makes more sense. So yeah, this is the end of the part. I've been a Boss Charlie Sims. Or, um, well, or just Charlie. Whatever you want to call me. There are your two options. Um, yeah. Sorry, I just hit the mic with my uh, my drawstring from my um, from my hoodie. Oh, well, Cassidy is actually just calling. She calling Eli Eliza? Yeah, she's like, what's happened? Oh, it's gone anyway. Well, she wasn't going to go anyway, Cassidy, so don't even worry about it. But yeah, this is me. This is my part. This has been episode two. I hope you've enjoyed it. Stay tuned for episode three. Hopefully I get better. Um, if you want me to stop talking as much, tell me. If you want me to talk more, tell me. If you want me to do anything else that is obviously, uh, well, that you know, that is doable, then just, just, just let me know. Yeah, thank you. Like, subscribe, 
and come back another time. That that's all I ask from you. Okay? Uh I'm out. Cinnabit.